Hey guys, my name is Omega Luke, and once again, I'm bringing you a Wrestle Crate unboxing the day it is delivered. So I hope you get to check this out and see exactly what you're probably missing out on. Ladies and gentlemen, available on all platforms and YouTube, he's the Apex Podcaster. He's, he's the, the wise, wise owl of professional wrestling. wrestling. He smells better than dude love with Sex Panther on. He's the king of fantasy booking. He is your favorite podcaster's favorite podcast. He is Omega Luke, and you're listening to the Omega Luke Wrestling Podcast. So I'm going to open her up in a sec, but I just want to remind everyone who does a WrestleCrate unboxing that the most important thing is to have fun. Okay, enough messing around. Let's see what's inside. So obviously, this is the day that WrestleCrate came out and it is a mystery WrestleCrate box. So all I know is that we do have the debut of Jordan Grace at WrestleCrate. So we're expecting some sort of Jordan Grace merchandise. Maybe it's a t-shirt. Obviously we had that Will Ospreay and Eric Bischoff t-shirt last year. And I'm probably gonna be expecting another Will Ospreay t-shirt in here um, as last time they got the sizes a bit incorrect, but they were very quickly to um, say that they were gonna post another Will Ospreay t-shirt in this box here. So if I do pull that out, that was January's, but um, there was no fuss about it whatsoever. They didn't question it. They simply just replaced it. I didn't have to send it back. It didn't cost me any money. So props to WrestleCrate. Everyone makes mistakes and they rectified it immediately. So well played. So as I said, we have the Will Ospreay t-shirt from last month's WrestleCrate. And I'm just gonna double check. I do have now a large Will Ospreay Russell Cray exclusive top from January 2019. So to start things off, we have the... <laughs> so to start things off, we have the Eric Bischoff sticker from the Eric Bischoff t-shirt that we got in the last month's Wrestle Crate, so that is exactly the same, but sticker version, so that's a good start. I do enjoy a good sticker, but I'm looking in here, and the next thing that I'm going to bring out is one of my favorite uh, people that I've ever spoke to, one of the favorite wrestlers that I've ever spoke to, and that is indeed Travis Banks. I met Travis at a wrestling show in Bristol, he was a lovely person to speak to, he took his time to chat to everyone there, and I had a good five minute chat with, with him, and I'm really enjoy I'm really glad that he's enjoying NXT. And that's pretty cool. I mean, I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, it's pretty solid. Very sturdy. But no, that's pretty cool. I'm happy with that. What else do we have here? Okay, it is a box. What is in the box? Now that is absolutely fucking glorious. We have a power bank. I mean, I don't know really what it's got to do with wrestling. It, I suppose it's the same. Keep powered at wrestling shows. Um, it looks like money in the bank, but it's power bank, very clever. And really good. I mean, this box cost me about 26 pound. I've got a t-shirt, a power bank. That's already like 20, 20 quid. Like, that's pretty decent. Oh, I really 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 like this next item so i am a huge british strong style fan i mean who isn't and i am a very huge tyler bay big strong boy fan and it is indeed a tyler bait big strong boy pin which i absolutely love he's like yellow so it's almost like a simpsons version which is very peculiar, but you can tell that's Tyler Bate. He is twiddling the old mustache. He has the scarf that they are synonymous with, with the mustache. Big strong boy writ around the pin. I am a big fan of that. Well done, WrestleCray. This is some very good items so far. Now this is very funny that we have this next item because not so long ago I did a video on the best 
Indie wrestlers. It was supposed to be a top five. It indeed became a top seven because Future Self came back in time to tell me to add two more people. And if you're confused what I'm on about, make sure you're subscribed and go check out my videos because he's been popping up a lot more um, than that. But I mentioned this guy called Dick Riley, a huge wrestler down south here in the Plymouth area and he is originally from Bristol and he, he is in fact the Chaos Champion and this is a Chaos DVD and it is indeed the main event Chaos King of Chaos Championship three stages of chaos it is Big Grizzly versus Dick Riley and that is going to be an incredible match both of those guys are very good on the British independent scene Dick Riley is there with Bino, who is also very good in the south area. Um, they are on the front. Don't be a menace, Chaos. I, that, that can't be that long. I mean, it doesn't actually say when it was. It doesn't say how long it was. But the people on it... I mean, you got Drew Parker on there. I mean, he is outrageously good in progress. The Hunter Brothers, who are very good... Um, on the British independent scene. Danny Jones against Bad Bones, which Danny Jones, I believe, is the guy who um, has come over recently from Japan and has been rocking it over there. And obviously the main event. I mean, Shane Strickland, Robbie X, Bino. It looks like Kip Sabian, Robinson and Kirby. I mean, that is a decent match as well. But that is the card that we have. Be very excited to watch that. I've always wanted to watch a bit of Chaos. So again... A DVD which is probably worth five to ten quid in this box and we're not even halfway through. Now this is really good. And this is a one month trial for the High Spots Wrestling Network which I'm definitely going to use because there are some incredible companies on there. PWG, um, Warrior Wrestling of course, among many others. Um, so that is going to be a good watch. Kevin Steen show as well. I bet that's got a good now, the reason why I got back into wrestling was because of that Kenny Omega versus Kazuchika Okada Wrestle Kingdom match that they had a few years ago now. Two years ago, three Wrestle Kingdoms ago. And Kenny Omega is the reason why I'm back into wrestling. That is the reason why I am called Omega Luke. And it brings me great pleasure to say that we have a Wrestle Talk edition, uh, issue eight, with the man himself right there on the front. So that's be probably quite an interesting read. It's a very thick book, probably a lot of great stuff in there to read. So, all in all, another great addition to this very promising Wrestle Great box so far. Indeed, I said that this box was to have a Jordan Grace piece. I was hoping for a t shirt. But maybe we don't get a Jordan Grace t-shirt this time. But we do get Thick Mama Pump. 8x10 signed by the woman herself. Incredible wrestler. Obviously the new Progress Women's Champion. And don't forget, I think she is 22 to 23 years of age. And she is already bossing the indie scene for women's wrestling. Absolutely outstanding. Absolutely love her. Can't wait to see what she does. Surely someone like AEW would want to pick up Jordan Grace. I mean, makes sense to me. Speaking of AEW, this next item comes from an AEW signee in the one and only Joey Janela. Another 8x10 signed by Joey Janela himself. I am a huge fan of Joey Janela. Absolutely love his work and Penelope Ford's work. Unfortunately, he's out injured right now. Obviously, he had that horrendous injury. It looked like a leg break. Um, and he's been injured for about nearly five months now, I'd say. But he is already signed for AEW. He is appearing on Being the Elite. Not a big fan of the, the skits that he's doing on Being the Elite. Nonetheless, I enjoy him anyway. I enjoy his matches. I enjoy his character. Very good at All In. And it's nice to see that he's still rocking to make by 10s for people like me to get. So that's very nice. Thank you very much, Joey. Because of course he watches these videos. Now the moment I've been waiting for, the t-shirt. We are guaranteed a t-shirt in every WrestleCrate box. And this one is very different and very nice. I can't work out who it is. Oh yes, I do. I cannot believe I finally got a bit of merchandise from the one and only Flip Gordon. There we have it guys, Flip Gordon. That is a nice t-shirt too. 
nonetheless, that is a very nice t-shirt. I'm very happy with that. I bet if you got this box, you would be very happy with that too. Absolutely sick tops and incredible items in here. Overall, very good box. I'm very happy with that. Let's go over to me in the outro section of this video as an overall thing to see what we got in February 2019's WrestleCrate UK box. So here we have it guys, this is what is in this month's WrestleCrate UK box. We have of course a Flip Gordon t-shirt, absolutely stunning t-shirt, the Tyler Bate pin which I'm very happy with. My first wrestling pin, may I say, I'm not a big wrestling merch guy until I really got into the podcast. Um, I only really got my first t-shirt last Christmas. So we also have the Travis Banks little toy thing, very sturdy toy. The power bank, which is good for wrestling shows. The Don't Be A Menace Chaos with Dick Riley and Bino on the front there DVD, which should be a very good card. We also have the Eric Bischoff sticker from the design that we had, the Eric Bischoff TV uh, t-shirt last month. The Wrestle Talk Kenny Omega issue 8 magazine, Jordan Grace 8x10, Joey Janela 8x10. Overall, a very good Wrestle Crate for February 2019. There we have it, guys. A very successful February edition of 2019's Wrestle Crate UK. A lot of very good stuff in there. Well worth the £26, I believe. So I hope you decide to not mess around next month, get on board and join WrestleCrate UK. I will leave a link in the description down below. Hopefully soon I can get a discount code for you guys or maybe a free gift code so that you can not miss out and get even more merchandise for your wrestling collection. But I am indeed Omega Luke. Make sure you stick around for tomorrow's edition of Fantasy Book Infaction. Make sure you stick around for Friday's edition of Wrestling Would You Rather with Xenia, who will probably be doing another WrestleCrate edition video herself because that is how um, we came to find each other uh, last month, I do believe. And until next time, keep your friends close, but keep Omega Luke closer.